flight boss, bitch, you know, for sure. You're not listening to the mind of an Terry's Moon. I'm not Archangel Uriel, and I'm here to carry out God duties and motherfucking responsibilities. And right now, we gotta talk about polar shifts, and we gotta talk about the positive and negative energy. Yin and yang, or whatever you wanna call it. But whatever interchangeable type of way, it really don't have nothing to do with these things, but I need this to be understood. There's something going on, right? And before I get into this, some could say that this may be the power that God gave you that the devil don't have. But for the most part, there's a special power with just being. With just being. Because look at it. Like, just being, not having nothing to prove, just being. Whatever you have to do, meditate, or however you do, you could. everybody got their own different ways based, based upon their elements and their astrological charts and things of that nature. You got your own ways of just being. But when you're in a state of just being, you develop more energy of just being yourself. Now, this is your real power. But check this out. For some strange reason, in this realm of reality, you're being made or you're being trained to just receive. Because when you look at your vessel and you look at the, the, the five senses you have or just life in general, you're receiving. When you go outside, you're receiving light. When you taste, you're eating. When you smell, you're receiving the, the smell. You see what I'm saying? When you touch something, you put it out, but you're receiving the, the resistance from it, whatever you touch. When you hear something, you're receiving the sound. So, there's realms of realities where this doesn't exist. I need you up for a disclaimer. But, for some reason in this realm of reality, you're being trained to receive. Now, when you talk about receiving, we have to talk about the positive and the negative uh, polar shift. Now, this has nothing to do with good or bad. I'm Archangel Uriel. I'm just strictly looking at the way life is when I come in everybody's realm of reality. Now, when I come in y'all realm of reality, if you guys are being trained to just receive, then for the most part, you're getting physically, emotionally, a.k.a. soul vibrational, and spiritually, a.k.a. your thoughts and ideas drained. Now, this is one of the reasons why you humans' physical body get tired. This is another reason why you humans um, can't understand how to blend the yin and the yang realm at the same time. See, the sun and the planets, they know how to interchange their female and male side at the same time. They right and left brain at the same time. But that has been lost to y'all because for some reason y'all have been trained to just receive. So, think about it like this. When you receive too many thoughts, right? In, in that realm, you get your, your spirit gets spiritually fed. So after a while, to exhaust the energy when you're full, what happened? You have to exercise it. So in that case, it goes to the soul. It goes because we know everything is frequency, vibration, and energy. Your spirit comes from the from the frequency, which is the space and the idea. The soul comes from the vibration, which is your seconds, your experience, your time. You see what I'm saying? Your realm of reality. Um, and the, the external is the energy, what matters and what becomes matter, what becomes solid. So once, once uh, you get spiritually fed, you get so many ideas, you have to exhaust that energy. So you have to feel one of those thoughts. So that's how you exhaust the spiritual energy. So you start, getting, you start emotionally feeling a way about certain thoughts. Then once you have so many feelings and emotions, once you got so many vibrations, you catch so many vibrations from your soul, uh, on your soul now, now you have, you have to... You have to clean your soul now. You have to, I mean, you have to energy drain your soul now. You have to exercise it. So now you have to express it through the physical form. And now once you express all these feelings and emotions, whatever like that, with your body, then your body get exhausted. Now your physical is tired. You see what I'm saying? Now, and then that's the only way you go to sleep. And that's the reason you go to sleep. When really, you're supposed to have the power to blend in the yin and the yang realm at the same time. But you're being trained. And look, this is what happens. When you're receiving, that's, that's, that's female, that's right brain, that's yin, that's round. So if you're doing more receiving than pushing out, then all the receiving is pushing and causing a polar shift to the left. Because if, look, if the wind is blowing, if the wind is blowing heavy to the right, which way your body going to blow? To the left. So if so much of this, uh, if you're receiving so much of these waves, then... You're going to be blown to the left, 
to the point that this is why another reason why everything is left brain. So we, we got to understand that there's beings actually controlling the currents beyond the, beyond the solar system. Like basically like the galaxy. There's beings there controlling the currents. See now, and th this is what we have to understand that everything is about current now. So when you want to under when you want to understand, ooh, I gotta light my blunt. <laughs> and all my fucking lighters is out because I'm all fires. I had to break all these motherfuckers. But look, when you want to actually talk about um, all you doing is receiving. Now we going we we have to figure out now how can we stop receiving more than more than putting out because we got to create some kind of balance here, right? This is the only way, and, and the balance, this is why I said, there's a strong press, there's a strong sense of just being. And that's if you meditate or anything. So, like, that's why I said at the beginning of the video, this may be the gift that God gave you that the devil don't have. Because just think about it, people who do a lot of things, they can't just be. You got a lot of people who just can't sit still. No, they just can't, they just can't accept their title. They just can't accept who they are. They got to be all they can be. They have to join the Navy, Army, whatever. They have to They have to be the most millionaire, whatever. They have to be all the... And then just look at the people who just don't give a fuck about that shit. They just be who they be. Be who they are. And then a person who stays in a state of mind of just being a, a whole... And, they, and, and it's like a currency when you're just being a whole lot. You know what I'm saying? What happens is you develop the energy and currency of just being yourself. So then when you do come out in the world and, and then you put yourself back in the, in the world of receiving... It's a more of a balance, so people are doing more receiving from you, and it's and it's of your source, and it's like a more of a balance. So you're able to, you know what I'm saying? So just think about, think about it. The most successful people is the people who tap into the energy of being themselves. So regardless of how they did it, some some people do it subconsciously based upon their NATO chart or whatever like that. But you know what I'm saying? Some people they tap. The more people who just be themselves, end up having the most of their own thoughts, feelings, and expressions. You see what I'm saying? AKA frequency, vibrations, and energies. So here's what happens. See, I've been in all realms of realities. So everything is about current. It just looked like money and exchange of goods and shit here. But when you are a celestial being and you are and say you are above the solar system, say, say you are you are a being in the galaxy. So it's a current flow. So it's like your spirit is always up there. And so when you just be yourself. Or just, alright, how you gonna get there is just being. So whatever you gotta do, smoke like me or go meditate, listen to your favorite songs. Start start to step into that energy. When you just being, your spirit up there, it's like, it's, it's traveling in the current. It's like the wave. Y'all watch them space shows and shit like that. Y'all see how it's up there is a, is a spiral. So you're in that shit. Everything is in the spiral. The solar system, Milky Way, all that shit. So when you are being that's up there controlling the whole current, you know what I'm saying, as a galaxy being, as one of those beings, um, your spirit up there too. But when you down here in physical, the reason why you even down here is because you you already fell short and you you don't understand half of that. So you're doing that in a lower spectrum. But I'm I'm Archangel Uriel. I, I experienced all this. I'm giving I'm giving y'all that what it looked like. I'm giving y'all how it is. As your spirit, it's just like a you you're just up there as like you're, you're floating. You look like an oversoul a little bit. You know what I'm saying? You're just you, you're you're part of the current. Your space is part of that space. You have like a you like you have a bubble within the ocean up there. It's like you part of that space within that space, right? Now, when you're just being yourself, your space is stronger, so you're clearing. You you going through the path. You're going through the current clear. So it's almost like you got some type of some type of technology that you can go through the current current and you can switch waves and and go back and do all kind of shit in the current as you please. When you receiving a lot. Your spirit up there in the current is receiving, so it's catching asteroids, it's catching dust, it's because you kind of look like a spine, just a spine a little bit, like a, like a, a see-through spine, and you know, and you're, you're catching, you're catching dust, you're catching space dust. It's like, and up there, it looked like space dust and shit like that, but down here, that's that's really thoughts and ideas from shits, you know what I'm saying? But it's currents, so up there, your spirit is catching that, so it's your spirit is like moving slower, and your spirit only could go with the wave of what you're getting carried on with. So if you got a heavy, if you just ran into like a heavy ass asteroid and that shit is blowing in a certain part of the wave and a whole other shit, it's taking your spirit in all kind of other locations. Down here, it play like, damn, you 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 stumble, you come in to stumbles and roadblocks and trials and tribulations and now you got all these kind of different ideas and you was gonna do something that, that you wanted to do, but a situation that you went through 
that depending on a person, place, or thing made you steer your, steer your direction and now you had to do this way. You know what I'm saying? That's how it is. It's going up there. You catching a whole bunch of shit and clogging your shit up. So down here is like currency. That's how you build your real currency. More balance. The more you, ha you have to balance. Because think about it. Think about how much, how much you're receiving. How much you can't be yourself throughout the day. You got a family. You got a job. You got things to do. You got responsibilities. You're receiving all these lights, from, and and that's AKA in a higher sense. That's you. That's just you receiving all these lights, and down here is made dense. So it's being played out as in situations. So it's just you receiving all these lights from the planets and the sun being filtered through the sun, and then it's getting played out through your life as situations and circumstances and shit like that. And just think about all. Just think about all the situations and circumstances you just can't be in. You just can't be. You got so much shit on your plate, like, damn, sometimes you just want to run away and lock yourself in a room for a second. Like, man, can I just be for a second? You see what I'm saying? So, it's, it's mechanisms in this world that's, and beings that's forcing you to the left and make you think, a, a, a.k.a. think. So now you're thinking that's the right thing to do. So now even when you, when you to yourself, you can't even meditate without thinking. You can't even just be to yourself without, you, you, you may... You're trained to think that's meditating. You got intellectual beings and humans who fake consciousness. I call them fake consciousness. They may be consciousness to y'all. Everybody on their own spiritual path and everybody need a string to get on the string. But I'm Archangel Uriel. I'm the highest conscious. So when I look at them, it's like they're, they're, they're smart, but they still, they're, they're teaching you because they don't know. They're naive. And that's 99% of the world. So they teach you to meditate. And at the same time, they teach you how to meditate when, when, they teach you to meditate, to think, to think about what you want and to feel and shit like that. When really, when you meditate, you're supposed to clear all thoughts. All this, you ain't fucking manifesting. That's law of attraction and manifest. That's a whole different story. I got videos to explain that, which I'm going to do some new videos on that for all my new subscribers. Thank y'all. I love y'all. I'm over 10,000 subscribers. I appreciate it so much. Thank y'all. I love y'all. But getting back to the subject, you know what I'm saying? When you just being, right? The reason why I say it's a special power in that because I, here's the key to balance. When you're just being, right, you're not receiving. So something must be ha something must be happening. And that must be the reason why it appeared like that when I was a galaxy being. You see what I'm saying? And why your spirit is up there doing the same thing. Because it's like your spirit is up here seeing the whole spectrum. Then your soul is just the experience. It's the experience and everything. Your soul is like dumb as fuck, but it's carrying all the memories and soul. So your soul do got wisdom. Then your physical body is in realms of reality is actually expressing these things as a vessel. So a lot of times you're going to see a lot of roadblocks in your way down here. And your soul is just experiencing like it's going to be like, I don't know. I got to get the information from the spirit. Then the spirit going to tell you to go forward. Now, if your soul be like, I don't want to experience that based upon the fight between the flesh and the, and the, and the spirit, because the body going to be like, it's too many obstacles. I can't go. I can't go between that bridge. I can't do all. I can't jump over all that. The spirit going to be like, motherfucker, it, it, that's not even what it really is. I see the whole spectrum. That's just an illusion. Your soul going to be like, your soul got to pick. Your soul got to be like, man, it's, I don't give a fuck. Whatever I got to experience. So whatever frequency vibration you on, that's, that's how much courage your soul going to have. Because if your soul got a lot of experience, your soul going to be like, all right, I did this before. I already know this is an illusion. I'm taking the spirit side. Or if your soul low vibration, though, it's going to take the flesh side. It's going to be like, oh, I never did this shit before. You might not have been here a lot of times. So your soul ain't have a lot of experience. So your soul going to be like, oh, I ain't do this shit. So your body going to take the long way. And you could have got there a lot faster if you listen to the spirit. But a lot of people have a lot of spiritual guides and a lot of other people, physical people here in front of or beside them. Them, that that help them that may been that may been here a lot more times than they have that that tell them that I tell them like Archangel Uriel nigga run through that car nigga run through the bridge nigga ain't that's just an illusion <laughs> and I ain't telling you to run through a bridge but y'all know metaphorically so you know what I'm saying that means it's something happening so you're building courage you're building I mean you're building currency you're building your more space so it's important to meditate because that's building a more positive so when you do go back out into receiving you're 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 putting out more energy also. So it's a balance. So you're able. So your receiving is more, and your pot, and your and your giving out is more balanced. So you're able to have a more balanced experience. So you're able to experience what you genuinely want to experience. You see what I'm saying? So we gotta we gotta get to a situation where we can't. We we got see. It's a lot of intellectual beings. They teach you. They teach you that 
to meditate and the shit like that is to think and you're really supposed to clear your mind because when you clear when when you when you thinking you're receiving you're receiving thoughts from the external overall you see what I'm saying we already know that's the devil so we need we we need to we need to get back to God you know I'm separating all this shit yeah we I'm Archangel Uriel we, I'm getting back now um we not we not gonna sit here and just uh, accept the fact that the God is the devil. No, we know how to, we gonna decipher, and we know that it's a true being out there that's not in conflict with itself. And I, I and I want to take the God energy that y'all that y'all put fucking God in, take God out of this human shit, and put it back to this rightful fucking place. But for the most part, this is one of the paths of getting there, tapping into that energy, and that's just being. So find you got we got to find more ways to to. Find more times uh, throughout the day that we can just be. So we can develop more currency of being ourselves. So when we go out here receiving, it's an even it's an even exchange. And we not getting the short end of the stick. To the point that we're receiving so fucking much just to get what we want. We got to put out more energy to intellectual beings who's, who's putting out the energy of giving you. And you got to praise them to receive what you want to receive. So you under their authority. So we got to attack these motherfucking beings and we got to start holding these motherfucking planets accountable. Stop trusting the motherfucking sign. Stop trusting Venus. Stop trusting Mars. Yeah, you got all those within you. You got a fucking being on each one of these planets. So you can utilize these motherfucking energies when you choose to. These motherfuckers is jealous of you. You can utilize this shit. Listen, I told you before, the higher you, the higher it's up, the higher you up, the more lower you want to experience. The lower you is, the more higher you want to experience. So yeah, you in 3D. Yeah, I know you got all this science on the internet. Yeah, you want to rise consciously aware. But goddamn, I'm going to tell you. The higher you motherfucking is, these motherfuckers are dying to experience shit down here. You think they you think they don't want to experience time into their pleasures and illusions? These motherfuckers can do it on impact. They get tired of that shit. They can do it through a, a, a split second. You know, see, the, the sun get tired of creating realms of realities for y'all motherfuckers. Sometimes he just want to play, it, and again, that sun want to be a he when it, it got both mechanisms. But that motherfucker just want to be down here. That's why he didn't recreate Jesus and shit like that through y'all. He want to come down here, have sex, and feel how that feel for hours and shit too. Shit, shit, Jesus is a faggot. That motherfucker, he want to see how men and motherfucking uh, women feel. And he, he want to see how it feels to kill and everything. Stop trusting these motherfucking planets. I'm telling you. You're not just from here. You got a lot of people who got only science that just preview that just preview you to Earth. That just preview you to this shit. Yeah, you got to be super uh, under nature. Nature and natural. It's a thin line between the two. I'm going to do a video on that. But all you got to just preview to nature. Na everything in nature ain't natural. I'm going to tell you that right now. That was the fucking reason why the people even the fucking uh, people even had the ability to make geome uh, uh, geometrical foods. GMO foods, whatever you want to call it. That tell you right there, for them to even have that kind of access, everything in this motherfucking earth that's fucking uh, nature ain't natural. So, so you got to decipher now as you want to be an earth being clean of earth and you want to keep bringing yourself back to earth because you, you, you praying the earth and you, and you thinking of it and trying to save everything on the earth and you want to come back to this earth and, and your ass is, and your ass don't even know how long, how long this motherfucking shit been going on that the fucking, fucking shit that's part of nature haven't been natural. Shit. Your motherfucking Kemet gods and all that shit, they technology fucking probably wasn't even natural. But it's nature to you because of the realm of reality you in. See, I've been in realms of realities that's diff. It's, everything ain't the motherfucking same. Earth. You got people who even kick shit talking about, um, the universe is inside you. Yeah, the universe is inside you. But the reason why people don't truly know themselves and they still try to, aka, learn every day and aka, receive knowledge every day, is because they're never because they're not getting the, the piece of understanding that th this universe ain't the only fucking one. So if you're just paying attention to this one and this realm of reality of thoughts, you're going to come to the conclusion that the universe is inside you. So you're going to find yourself thinking that just going within is ways of figuring out everything. When I've been in realms of reality, once you go within, there's a, there's a without and a within, motherfucker. Did y'all know that? There's, when you go within, there's a without in that motherfucker. I'm going to save that for another fucking video, though. 
Let's get fucking balanced, my motherfucking soul group. We gonna get balanced out this motherfucker, and we gonna build our currency. So when we out here and doing all this motherfucking receiving, we gotta even, we gotta even exchange. AKA, we got as enough knowledge and wisdom and currency as these motherfuckers. AKA, we gonna experience and manifest just as much as these motherfuckers uh, that's out here pushing out these theologies and these motherfucker beings that we need to attack. That's pushing us, pushing this theology out here that you do, that you need to do more receiving than motherfucking uh, pushing out. And it's, it's wearing down on your fucking physical soul and your spirit. And it's making you motherfuckers go to sleep and can't even control your motherfucking sleeps because you being controlled as a vessel in that motherfucking realm. And this is motherfucking one of the the reasons why and we're gonna tap into the real fucking god energy flight boss goddamn air